You go into the kitchen to look for a snack late at night, and you just don't know what to make. Well, I'm going to make this decision a little bit easier for you. I'm going to teach you how to make the perfect snack, and this would be a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. First, you're going to need, need to gather your ingredients, which are peanut butter, jelly, and two slices of bread. Normally, it takes about two tablespoons of peanut butter. And you're also going to need utensils. For example, you're going to need a paper towel and a butter knife. Now that I told you what you need to make this delicious snack, here's how you make it. You're going to get one ingredient and put it on a slice of bread. And then, with your other ingredient, you're going to put it on the other slice. A little secret that I would like to share with you is you can put your peanut butter on one sli on both slices and then put your jelly, and this will keep the jelly from coming out both sides. Now that you've created this wonderful snack, I'm going to tell you how I enjoy it and some interesting facts. You can slice the sandwich diagonally, horizontally, however you prefer. And you also can eat this with a glass of milk, which I love. And another way to make it oh so wonderful is to toast your bread and it will make the peanut butter and jelly smooth and warm, which makes it even better with milk. Some facts about the sandwich is that it's 432 calories, which is, makes it a heart-healthy snack. It originated in North America, and a company by the name of Smuckers invented a crustless sandwich that, or a peanut butter and jelly sandwich that you can microwave. I hope your decision on your late night snack is much easier. Now that you know how to make the peanut butter and jelly sandwich, I hope you enjoy. Thank you.